Whoops. Uh, hold on. Let me. Hold on. Let me. Hold on. Oh god, I'm getting diaboloed into infinity there. Um, hey! <clears throat> Excuse me. My stream preview wasn't up, so I had to, like, refresh everything. Uh, hey, everyone. I am back with the, uh, hopefully the finale of Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles. And then we'll be moving on to, uh, Legend of Mana after that. Uh, so, uh... First things first, kind of just to recap here. Uh, I have not streamed in, like, over a week. My last stream, I think, was Friday, October 2nd. When I streamed this last, and I was like, oh, I'll finish it this weekend. And, uh, it didn't happen. I didn't stream Saturday, I didn't stream Sunday like I wanted to. Then I didn't stream Monday. Then I didn't stream Tuesday. Wednesday, Thursday, or Friday. Uh, it was a combination of depression, being busy with voiceover stuff that I needed to, like, record that week. That just took every day. And then, uh, also just being stuck at work late a couple nights, and also more depression. Uh, it sucks. It really does, and I don't know how to manage it properly. All that matters is that, uh, I'm back right now. Uh, hopefully I'll be back on track to, like, do the streams I want to do this upcoming week. There's gonna be days where I don't stream this upcoming week already. I already have it planned out, but, uh, hopefully everything else works out properly. Anyway, we got four more dungeons here to do. If it comes down to me not being able to beat these, I will just go multiplayer. Even though I haven't done that the entire game. Because, uh, I have no qualms with, with cheaping out the last few here. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, we'll keep cure- we'll put, um... Oh, right, I have the Holy Ring. I forgot I got that last stream, so I don't need, um... I don't need two slots to use Holy anymore. I could just use it as is. It was really nice. And then there's also a Gravity Ring and a Meteor Ring. It's just literally holy. Okay, cool. Like this remix, it's pretty good. actually have the uh, holy element? No, it doesn't. They removed it. Skeletons in the forest, huh? Oh, god. Oh, yeah, it's this again. Forgot about this. The reason I don't like these dungeons. I do believe this is going to be an issue. Though to be fair, do I really need... So here's the thing, I think all of the relics, the good stuff you get is just dropped from... chests, so I don't really need to kill the enemies if I feel I'm good enough to move on. Though I should probably get, uh... at least one, uh, or two of an element. Yeah, that's why people were talking about. The only one that really matters is the last dungeon, which is going to be way too hard anyway. So this might just be me cowering away from enemies. Oh my god, that's a giant cactor. I'm going to be honest, I wanted to stream a lot more today, and I just kind of got caught up. Uh, doing other stuff. Which I probably didn't even need to do. I just... I don't know. 
anxiety is really weird. Pressed flower. That's not an item. Or not a relic. Probably a, uh... Yeah, it's, oh, it's this. Small pressed flower. Which is, but also isn't for crafting. It's not good. One of them would drop something, but no luck. Okay. Might be time to start bomb rushing. Best to just have myself carry the chalice here. Uh, shoot. Let me carry the chalice, Capel. So I don't know. It's, it's just getting too difficult at this point for me to just do what I was doing, get through here. So this is the easiest one in the last few, so I probably, uh, I think it might be time to just swallow my pride and group up.
Uh, multi. I haven't actually done this before, so this is all a new experience at this point. All I know is that Mog's not going to be there, and that's going to be rough. So they give you a stone of cure automatically, which doesn't really help me. That makes multiplayer even way harder. Poison sucks in multiplayer. I'm certainly hoping someone joins up soon. Okay, so what happens now when you fail multiplayer? It really t oh wow, okay, just to let you continue, that's really good. Well, that's good to know, but uh, would really like help. <laughs> Maybe I can uh, wait for a group before I go in there. That's kind of why I didn't want to do this. Oh, wait, what? Can I not leave during multiplayer? Do I actually have to die and, like, get a game over to leave a multiplayer? Ugh. All right, multiplayer can't pause. Shit. Healing kit. What do I have equipped? Do I have? I don't have frost stuff equipped. Oh, okay. going or if I should head out and wait for someone. I 
the thing is, there's drop and drop out for this mode for multiplayer. Hey, Celine, how you doing? Stretch of this massive article on Tawny Owls. That's good. That's cool. Uh, you, you know what? I'm gonna take the opportunity to go back to the world map and try to just see if I could group up instead of uh, waiting for people to join mine. <clears throat> Because I'm starting to realize it does not matter that much if I join a quest in progress. As long as I clear them, I'm happy. And since we're at the point now where I can't really be too upset about not doing this on my own. Maybe I can host. Uh... Oh, you can do Mount Valenge multiplayer. So these two I still gotta do. That one I still have to do. That's seven stars. And I'm in the desert, which is six. So I got two six stars, one... Need help? Let's say let's have fun. Oh, does it just do the same thing? Ah, uh, that's probably not good. The Gigantors don't hurt as much as they, the uh, normal ones do, just because they only use ice, apparently. They don't attack normally. find a game in progress because clearly no one's uh no one's gonna be biting here I, I thought i was gonna get people like immediately but i don't want to wait for people to join because i'm not uh i'm not someone else that can say i need help and have like fi 15 people apply to help immediately <laughs> hey thank you for the follow appreciate it always do I will just join a quest in progress here. I'm at the point where I'm done caring because I've been playing this game for 45 hours on stream. So I just kind of want it done. I kind of want to get these last four dungeons out of the way and finish it up. Uh, pick... Oh, pick, dun no, pick dungeon. Okay, there we go. Is it Moonlit Desert, Rainy Ruins, Foggy Swamp, uh, and what was the last one? Uh, Goblin Festival. That was it. Rainy Ruins. Really? That's it? There's one person playing it right now. Oh, I don't want to do that one first. Thank you. 
So this is why I stuck with single player. Matchmaking failed. Oh my god, really? I feel like it's not worth it because there's just not enough people playing. It doesn't help that the online in this game is region locked, which is really, really dumb. Very, very dumb. Among Us being the new thing. Yeah. I want to do an Among Us stream at some point. My Asthma Pit, which I've already... Uh, I've already cleared that one. Yeah, you know what? Let's do Rainy Ruins. Let's just go right ahead to that one. Since someone's already running it, I might as well. And I haven't finished it yet. Okay. So this is multiplayer. It's a frenetic mess. I'm assuming they haven't done much of this yet because they are uh, still in the first room here. So the three of the four of us are geeks, which is great. It's like a small version of the Mantis enemies. I've never seen those before. How you doing? I saw that Soma's here too. Oh, I don't have a gravity ring. It is you, Soma. Hey, how you doing? I mean, I, I'm asking how you're doing, but I, I was just in chat with you, so I don't know. This is a clusterfuck. Also, way easier. Oh, hey, Mandy. Oh, you're the one who just followed me. My new friends are all here. Twitch lets you put a stream in the background on your phone, yep. Gee. You can fall asleep to me rage quitting later when I can't find anyone to go in the dungeons with me. Yes, the music in this game is all really good. Oh, a chunk of Electrum. Nice. This game, the music in this game is very, uh, Renaissance. On purpose. Wait, hold on. Wait. Man, being able to cast haste at any time is really good. What are they doing for that? Wait, they can't... How are they doing that anyway? You can't combine spells in multiplayer. So I'm like wondering how they're getting haste like that. <clears throat> What's causing you to struggle with jump? Well, this is the post game, and I've, I've played the whole thing single player, and it's really not meant to be played single player. 
you're really supposed to be playing this multiplayer, which I'm doing right now. I did not do that the entire game. And, uh... Th these post-game dungeons are getting way too hard to, like, actually do it single player now, so I'm, like, just resorting to multiplayer. The problem is there's not enough people playing, so I can't do the dungeons I want to clear yet. That said, I do seem to be about at the same level as everyone else here, so that's nice. In terms of, uh, skill. It's like, I don't know if I'm supposed to, like, if other people don't get the money if they pick it up or whatever. The problem with the post game is that the, they just have enemies sorted in a very weird way that makes it very difficult to fight through alone. Like, they'll have sets of four enemies everywhere that just gang up on you quickly. Okay, so everyone does get everything. Because I just got a Stone of Thunder, even though I did not pick it up. You came to the wrong neighborhood, motherfucker. Oh, they must all have gravity rings. Damn, I wish I had that. So it's better to have more people so that the enemies have more targets. It's more that the game is built around multiplayer. The game is not built around single player at all. So it's much harder to do it single player. Even though they do give you an advantage by having someone to carry the chalice. That thing that that guy right there is holding. Uh, someone always has to carry it because if you're not in the chalice's range, you start losing health. Because the world is full of poison. Uh, but apparently it's not it, It's not much of an advantage in the post game. The post game is just too difficult. Region yes, it is region locked. It's really stupid. It's it's a really dumb decision by Square Enix. I don't know why they chose that. It's cross-platform, so I can play with people on PS4 and PC and uh, iOS. Because right now, you can see who's playing on Nintendo Switch. Actually, am I direct monitoring on? Because I can't hear myself. Like, you see how three people have a Switch icon underneath their names, that they're all on Switch. The one, Ghastly does not have that, so he's either on PC, or he's on PS4, or rather, a uh, phone. I can't... Is it on PC? I think it's just PS4, phones, and, uh, Switch. So you can play cross-platform, but you're limited to people in the same region, which is really dumb. Which might have to do... I would say it might have to do with phone stuff, but at the same time, there's plenty of phone games where you play with people in, uh... Japan and Europe, so, I don't know. The game is fun, it's kind of mindless at times, it is a lot of uh, just bashing through enemies, but... Oh, I think they're all picking it up. I thought they were leaving it behind. I think it's just you don't see the other players pick it up because it's yours. I think it might be the same way with all the items, actually. This is actually the last dungeon in the post game. This is supposed to be like the final one you go to. 
Wow, this is way easier. I could have finished this game like two streams ago if I did this. This game's actually a remake. Uh, it's a remake of an old GameCube game, which had only a local multiplayer. So there's some weird, like, limits on how the multiplayer works as a result, because it was kind of based around a single system. And they didn't completely redo it. Also, none of the post-game existed in the GameCube version. Uh, only the main story did. So this is technically all new content for the game. Oh yeah, because look, they're all, they all bunch around it afterwards, so they're picking stuff up. I'm just not seeing them do it. back at least, which is nice. At 50 before the last stream, and then I went down to 19 at the beginning of this one. I actually didn't miss a lot of this dungeon. They kind of went to the left and then immediately went to the right. And then the left still had enemies, so... I think I could consider myself participating in a majority of this one. These people also seem like they've done this many, many times, so... Oh, you know what? They also have the weapons that just let you do the, the spells without fusion. That's probably why they're doing it so easily. Do they get new bow mods that we can use for this game? I don't think so, actually. It's some, someone completely different. Insanely easy. Also, that puzzle's a lot easier, too. I spent an hour trying to open that door in single player. Because those things do not stay un uh, destroyed for very long. Oh, you see, say gravity. <laughs> Fire a Light. I think that's a new one. 
Not that it really matters. I don't care about the health effects that much anymore. Freefall version of Mr. Dun well, it's not. It's not turn-based. This is um. It's honestly more akin to kind of like I don't know how to put like what game was I comparing this to earlier? Um. It's almost more like a dungeon. It's a dungeon crawler. It's a, like a brawling dungeon crawler, where you kind of just go and, and beat things up. Also, wow, I'm hitting the combos a lot easier. Yeah, Mystery Dungeon uh, didn't have the multiplayer function of this. Anime Diablo, yeah, that's the perfect way of putting it, actually. Whoa, we're lagging. Defending. The hell. There we go. Do you have a favorite Final Fantasy game? Um, six was my first. Oh my god, I died again. Um, Wow, I would not have been able to do this section alone at all. Six was my first, and I really liked it. Um, but uh, seven is really good. Seven remake was amazing. I streamed that earlier this year. Um, I absolutely love seven remake. Uh, and I'm, I like Kingdom Hearts, most of them. Which I guess is like a spin, spin off Final Fantasy, technically. Twelve was your first and still your favorite. Twelve was I, I I know twelve was really good. I've been meaning to try it, but at the same time it's like I, I was in the I started playing three and I never finished it and I feel really bad because I really want to but at the same time three just really lost my interest part of the way through. I've played most of the King Hearts games. Um, I mean, if you have the, uh, if you have PS4, get the story so far. It has, like, every playable game. Well, most of them. 
epic Mickey games that look cool. I um I never played that. I've heard the first one was pretty good. I don't know about the second one. The enemies are focal. Oh wow, that, that sucks. I'm not gonna get a high score here. Up. Yep, I'm uh, I'm doing a whole group today, Walls. Cause I have to I, I'm like fucking up the dungeons, so I need to uh I really need to group up here. Oh why did it get moved all the way over there? That was weird. Trading ESPN Sports Cash to get a house ball back. I did not know that. Let him add tight. Say the line. There it is. Every time you die enough, I tend to sit through like 10 minutes of cutscenes to get back to where you are. Yeah. 10 is a very story heavy, uh. Cause you know what? Cause that was the first PS2 game, and they were like, "Well, you know what? We have to, uh, we have to load this up with voice acting and cutscenes to make it cool and new." It's also a very easy game, apparently, which I, I don't know. I've never actually played it, but Universal sat on him for almost seven decades. Wow. Oh, wait, right. Twelve is an immense improvement. Open world, very fun to play. Yeah, I've seen most of. I've seen some of twelve. Oh, the door's open. What am I, what am I doing? I don't see the. Ri there's a Kiraga multiplayer only, but it like there's no point because Kiraga already Kira already heals everyone in range. I don't know if I or like open world games. Truth is, I don't play a lot of open world games. I play Breath of the Wild, and that's kind of it. Speaking of, uh, Age of Calamity is looking really nice. I'm looking forward to that in uh, November. That's a definite stream. That's a story stream at least. Puyo Puyo Tetris 2 is another game coming out that I'll stream. This album called FF Celtic Moon a decade ago. It slaps really well. They won't put it on Spotify. It takes me off because it's such an underrated album. There's not, for some reason, a lot of the modern Final Fantasy music is not on Spotify, even though Square does have an account and does put music on it.
I'm surprised there's someone here with only six hearts. It's kind of ridiculous. I don't know. A lot of their albums... I don't know. There's, there's rights issues with the music, probably. Man, man tight. We cleared out everything over there already, except for the left path, uh, which is where we're heading, I guess. Or not. What are we doing? Oh no, we are going back, never mind. I forgot you can't, uh, you have to go the long way around. It is so hard to keep track of myself, considering that three of our party members are the same species. I'm the only one with the Moogle Hammer. Oh, he's using a DLC weapon too, though. He's using the Executor. Okay, I guess we're just finishing the dungeon. That's probably a Mimic. Alright, gonna need the Holy Ring for this, probably. Assuming the boss is the same weakness as the, uh... As the original version of this dungeon's boss. I probably could have finished this game like four streams ago, total, if I had been doing multiplayer the entire time. Oh, Skip the putsy. Ow. Up your menu while you're down. I'm back up to the mid-30s on Phoenix Downs. Which I'm now going to proceed to blow with this. I don't even know what this boss is called. If, is, it, is it a Turbo Lich, or is it just a Lich? Like the other one. Not anymore, though. We're good. Oh, you could just cast Holy on that, too. Okay, so you don't need to take it off. camera just wouldn't focus on the uh guys he's invincible we gotta get the other one the problem is that the camera always focuses on the chalice not the character so if someone needs to go off screen uh, it's a bit rough
Holy! Holy! We did it. The witch has been bitched. I don't know what that version's called, though. It's a witch in the normal version. Rainy Ruins boss. I don't have any letters today, Kupo. That's a first. Oh, it's called Testament. That's cool. All right, uh, what are we doing? Is Ghastly the leader, I'm guessing? I did not fulfill the bonus uh, thing here at all. Wow, they got pick up items? Damn, that's easy. I got the bitch, the, the hard ass fuck wad one. Ghastly selecting an artifact, Saria. Oh, oh, so choose. Oh, so that's what happens. Your place determines what you choose. No joke, the Moogles in this are cute. Yeah, they are. The Moogles in this are really cute. Also, regarding Monster Hunter, I have not played a Monster Hunter game. Um, I was going to play... Like, I've tried 3 and 4 on the 3DS, and I didn't like it that much. So then I... But then I tried Generations on the 3DS, and I liked it. But I didn't have the money to play it. And then when it came out on Switch, I didn't have time. So hopefully when Rise comes out next year, I'll be getting that. Probably won't stream it, because it's like a 200-hour game, but... I'll definitely be playing uh, Monster Hunter next year. Man Eater, Memory Crystal. Oh, I could choose a Memory Crystal. That's cool. Oh, oh there was a Meteor Ring. Oh, I couldn't take it. Whatever. Leo Namio, Louis. I guess I'll take Leo Namio. Uh, no. That would just make us go through this again. Yeah, the online, also the party system's not that good, because you can't really just take the same party to another dungeon. You have to disband it and make a new party, or leave and make a new party. Alright, well, at least I beat Rainy Ruins. I don't care if I got the Meteor Ring. It would've been nice, but I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna be upset about that. Also, because I wasn't the leader, that doesn't count as a, uh, as a miasma drop, or mer drop for me. So it doesn't make time go forward, not that it really matters, because there's no point in advancing the year at this point in the game, since I've beaten it already anyway. Yeah, it's, the multiplayer, st well, I mean, that's how it worked in the other game, because the other game it would be, you would have the f four guests join you from, like, other files, and they just wouldn't get any story progress. So that's kind of how it works here. Join. Uh, Goblin Wall, Mind of Cathurges, Come on, Lenari, Goblin, Ma uh, Mushroom Goblin, Bale Loose. Sl uh, these are all like really early game. Moonlit. These are the three that I still need to do. Nothing. Why do you not progress the story multiplayer? You can, but only if you're the host. Here's the thing, though. The way the story progresses isn't... It's not... So dungeons don't really progress the story themselves. What happens is, after you've cleared a dungeon, you'll get a drop of myrrh in your chalice. And once you've gotten three, it advances the year forward. But the thing is, you could do the same dungeon over and over. It's just you won't get any myrrh for doing it more than once. Or if you're guesting in another person's party, you won't get it. 
And these dungeons are meant to be tackled like multiple times, so it's not that bad. Because you're likely going to be doing it multiple times anyway. Plus, I'm in the post game where, again, the fact that there's murder drops means nothing. Uh, there's no point in advancing time in the post game at all, because I've already done all the stories. The way the story plays out is it actually happens on the road. When you're moving your caravan between spots on the map, you'll get stopped and, like, you'll see a cutscene. And, like, you'll see that cutscene for that year, and then the following year, something else will happen. So it kind of works like that. But by this point in the game, I've already seen all the cutscenes, because I've beaten it. I've beaten the story. I'm just doing bonus dungeons now. Alright, well, that's one down. To be honest, if I don't finish this by midnight, I'm just going to stop because at this point, I've finished all but three of the bonus dungeons, and since there's no story related to it anyway, I'm just, like, I'm ready to just say I'm done. I want to get to back to Legend of Mana so I could finally get through that game. Raise Ring, Phoenix Down, Fire Ring, Holy Ring, Pure Ring. I guess if anyone's watching that's playing, there's my lobby ID. Uh, feel free to join. Sorry, I'm just uh, clicking through some stuff here. <laughs> I just saw that tweet, Nessie. He was like, hey, it's me when I stream. I'm gonna retweet that real quick. He sounds like how Waterdeep Dragon Heist worked. Oh, sounds like four mini campaigns they change with the seasons. Yeah, it's kind of like that. I'll grab a drink of water too while I'm here. If anything, I'm, oh, that's how, okay. Need Phoenix down. 32. Nice. I had 19 at the start of the stream, so I got over 10. I took a sippy, don't worry. I'm hydrated. So stream plans for this week are um, either tomorrow or Wednesday, or both, I'm not sure yet, I'm not going to stream. Which I know, I just took nine days off, so it's like, it's dumb. But I don't know which day yet. It's going to be one or the other, or maybe both, I'm not entirely 100% on it. Oh, someone joined, nice, cool. And then, um... Oh, we killed it. Designer goggles. Tuesday is gonna be Smash for Steve. I'm actually really looking forward to that. I had no, I, I was kind of mixed when he got announced, but man, I I really want to play as him. I'm looking forward to that. That's gonna be Tuesday. Might do Mario 35 with that as well. And then uh, if I stream Wednesday or Monday, and then Thursday and Friday uh, will be Legend of Mana again. Oh shit. Very well. Probably head to bed in ten early work days all this week. Oh, that's right. Do they at least let you leave an hour early, or do they keep you there for nine hours? Because I feel like that's not right if they're not going to give you, like, extreme overtime for that. Yeah, we'll, we'll come back to that. They keep you there, but you're getting overtime. Okay, that's good. Uh, 
I need to equip some resistance. Oh good, someone else joined. Perfect. Yeah, we can do it. Oh, someone else joined. Nice. Got a full party. Perfect. Gonna do it now. Barely keep your eyes open. All right, honey. Thank you for stopping by. I appreciate it. I'll talk to you tomorrow when I'm at work and I don't want to be at wait at work. I'll be too boo boo. Where am I? Oh, I got caught in the on the bush. Tiny crystal. Is there a haste ring? Because they're casting it with one without combining spells. Wow, this is so much easier with the party. Dragon's Whisker. It's new. I'll say these groups of four enemies are way easier when you actually have four people to take them down. Because that's the whole thing. The post-game in this, the post-game dungeons have this thing where they have four enemies bunched together, like those skeletons, and it's always like two of them do range attacks, one of them will do close range, and the other one will stun you constantly. my defense a bit in order to have storm resistance so I won't get stunned. Oh. 
Connected. That sucks because you don't get any artifacts that you collect then. So what happens if one player jumps down a whirlpool multiplayer? Wait a minute, did, I, did that Phoenix Down revive me? Did his own Phoenix Down revive me? That was weird. Elven Mantle. That is for someone else. Oh, nice. Uh. Does someone else want to pick that up? I don't know where to go. So it only works once the entire party's in there. Otherwise, you just stand on top of it. And down we go. Wait, why? Oh, I think you're wrong. Why am I not attacking?
Pull up the menu while you're dead. That'd be nice. Spam cure. Instant win. What's my bonus condition here? Pick up items. Perfect. Beautiful. So I'm doing good. Why do we go back down here? What are you doing? You alright there? Oh, they just get teleport. Why is he running to the left? That's really weird. I relate to that guy. Yes, same. Oh, he's playing as uh, one of the characters. me down. Meanwhile, you're just running to the right or left. You're letting me down pretty hard. Oh, look, he's participating now. That was weird. to Mr. Run Left, dude. Thank you, Parsnip. a chest over there, did we?
scoot our way down here. Maroon? Yeah, I don't know. That's a good question. That's a that's a named character too that they're playing as. At least to give revive. Thank you. Hard to tell because he's casting the spell at the same time. Either that or he's shouting water balloon. <laughs> Thanks, Izzy. I appreciate you sticking around. What the? Cactors? Mini cactors. No one uses spell fusion in multiplayer, huh? It's all just whack and uh, have weapons that already have high level spells in them. Slot that's stopping me from a low poly Dark Souls boss. Sure, I don't need that there.
was ridiculously quick compared to doing that single player. Matters. New diary entry. Hail yeah. Google at your service, Capo. Capo. I have a letter today, Capo. The boss of this was just called uh, Antlion, just like the normal one. When were you? When you were born? How many years have you gone by since I gave birth to you? You were frail at first, so I was deeply worried. But you've grown so strong. Perhaps I worried too much. Yep. Thank you, mother. Yes, mother. Uh, here, take a piece of mithril. Yeah, I did it. I got your reply, Capo. Thank you. See you again, Capo. <laughs> Ah, number two. Okay. Well, that means I get the second choice. Uh, memory crystal. I should probably just take the memory crystal. What's this? Dusk. Oh, I thought that said Dusk Salad. Yeah, I'll just take Memory Crystal. Memory Crystals let you use the appearance of another character. Uh, the Rio G there is actually uh, a character from the game rather than a custom one. None of the other characters are, though. Uh, Dissolve Party. I'm not doing this again. Not bad. Two down, two to go. Oh, it doesn't even show the uh, other people I've played with. Alright, got two more to go. I just said that. Let's see, is anyone already uh, tackling it? So what is it, the Goblin Festival and then something, Swamp? Miasma Pit, no, that's not it. No. 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 Foggy Swamp, that was the other one. And then the Goblin Festival. Nothing. Wait, what does uh, switching that thing do? Uh, switch display. Oh, it just shows their stats instead. Wow, this person's been doing nothing but team adventures, huh? What is that face? Oh, that's a Lilty with one of the... Um, with one of the masks. How long do you plan on streaming? Today is probably going to be a long time. Because it's only 10. Uh, I want to finish this and then do like a whole stream of... Uh, of uh, Legend of Mana. That said, if it gets to be like another like hour and a half and I haven't finished these last two dungeons, I'm going to uh, probably just call it and stop streaming it. And then just move on. So I'm probably going to be streaming like... Maybe like another five hours still. I don't know yet. I usually only stream three hours, like from midnight to 3 a.m., but uh, this week or today is a little bit of a, an exception. Uh, let's... Veterans uh, need help. What did I say last time? 
Uh, no, not farming. Drops hunting artifacts, we'll say. Three, open, good. Probably gonna end up passing out before Legend of Mana. It's all good. The stream is to kind of make up for lost time since I went through... Since I went nine days without streaming. Uh, raise, Phoenix down, Holy Fire. Yeah, that sounds about right. Interested in that game. Definitely want to play it at some point. I've been enjoying it. Well, I mean, I, I played it once last month. Right before I started it. Right before my, uh... Actually, not before. It was it was an anniversary stream. And, uh, I started playing it, and then I just never went back to it, because every week since the beginning of September, I've, like, had huge gaps in my streaming schedule. Last week, I didn't stream at all. Week before that, I missed four days. The week before that, I missed four days. The week before that, I missed three days. And I wanted to stream on a lot of them, so I was like, ah, oh, I really need to get back into it, but then... Stuff happened, and I got anxiety, and I also just couldn't make the time. So I just didn't. And I was just struggling to get through this game. And what else did I play other than this? I played another game, too, recently. Mario 64. That was it. I played Funny, funny Walking Man. This dungeon is long and annoying. I also never read the Selkic texts here. Oh god. Um, I never read the Selkie texts in this dungeon before. I read the first two and then I got killed. The ancient Selkic texts! Ow. Never received speed runs and task rates from R64. That's right, you never had a 64 when you were a kid, right? You had it you didn't play until the GameCube. Can't wait to play it. It's fun. The f Here's my opinion on Mario 64, and this is like an honest opinion. No bullshit. The first half of the game is really good. The second half is very, very annoying, because it's like not meant to be plowed through. Hey, Keep his revenge, how you doing? It is a game worth experiencing, I'll say that. It is very much worth playing. Uh, but once you get to the second floor, uh, and, uh, prepare for the game to become a lot less fun. Thank you, I appreciate that very much. Uh, all right, I got I lost my Phoenix down. Me, no, not yet. Put that back later. Yep. I figured it was you because the name is the same. Uh, right, raise ring on. Let's be honest, we're not using any spells here. Oh, I saw the cure ring. We got someone else, cool. Almost a full party. Uh, wait, what? Oh, oops. One second. Oh, I don't have the, uh, yeah, whatever. I appreciate the assist. I went through the last two dungeons with random people. Would you believe that I played this entire game single player up until now? 
the very last, my last few runs of this, and it's, it's this is the first time I'm doing multiplayer. Uh, nothing up there, right? No. Okay. Yeah. This is, um, this is the first time I've actually bothered to play single player. It is a lot of fun. It's a lot less frustrating, that's for sure. Trying to do these bonus stuns in single player was a pain in the ass. Not hitting it. Carry? There we go. I do like how the game is drop in, drop out. It makes it uh, very easy to join games. I just wish that the uh, friend system and the region locking wasn't really a thing. Because grouping up for different parties is kind of annoying. If you're going to change dungeons, rather. Uh, on a smoke yet. I'm not a real big fan of the of the four enemy layout, where it's like the four, like the caster, the stunner, uh, the ranged attacker, and then the uh, physical attacker. Just because it's very deliberately made to be done multiplayer, and it's like impossible to do it in single player at all. Which is why at this point I've just kind of given up on finishing the game single player. Not that I, I mean, I know the focus is multiplayer and I'm fine with that. I'm really enjoying this. Okay, what are we doing? Um, but I do feel like anyone who wouldn't have access to multiplayer is kind of missing out at that point. And I'm not even doing this to grind. I'm doing this just to beat each dungeon once. Hard mode dungeons are made with multiplayer in mind. Yeah. I mean, the whole game was made with multiplayer in mind. It's, um... Just definitely impossible to do this single player after a while. And I would have liked to have done it just as, like, a test of my own abilities, but... I'm not gonna push for it at this point. Maybe if I grinded some stuff out later, but this is... This is it. I'm done after this. This and Goblin Festival, and then... It's all over. It's chaotic, I'll say that. It's kind of hard to, like, do proper spell fusion and raising people when I can't even tell where some people are. <laughs> I lose track of myself sometimes. I had defend selected again. Shit. I really hate how defend takes up a slot. Oh, come on. Alright, I had two Phoenix downs equipped. One thing I've said since the beginning is I wish they would have uh, implemented auto filling for uh, item slots, for, especially for Phoenix Downs. Like you use one that just puts another one from your inventory there. But I guess I could kind of see how in multiplayer that may not be the best thing to do. And 
me to put any back in my in my inventory. I was standing right in that too. Wait, one second. There we go. Wait, yep, there's a chest over here, isn't there? Or is it just monsters? Nope, there's a chest. Also, when someone picks up an artifact, it doesn't pick it up off the other screens, right? Because I keep thinking everyone's skipping them, but then I'm like, oh wait, I think I think they're just picking them up and it's not disappearing off their screen. It's like that with any item, right? Because I thought it might have been a competition to see who could grab it, but I guess it's really not that big of a deal then. Alright, area two. Only for Magisite works kind of like Diablo 3. So that's the thing, I haven't actually played Diablo, so... Oh, that's a nice voice crack right there, too. Fantasy Star Zero, not like Fantasy Star 1 and 2. <laughs> Episode 1 and 2. Fantasy Star uh, Online, Episode 1 and 2. If you... It was, it was whoever... If one person grabbed it, it would just be gone. It would only be on one screen. But, uh... I know later games fix that. I did a run of the rainy ruins earlier, and um, they dr it dropped the meteor ring, but I wasn't able to get it because I was uh, I got fourth place because it was defeat enemies with focus attacks, and I'm like, oh fuck that, I'm not doing that. Chronicles Part 13, Zai finally uses multiplayer mode. And realizes he could have beaten this game in 10 streams instead of 13 if he had done so since the beginning.
like my casting is slower. Maybe the game's just lagging a little bit. chest up here in this mode, this version. from a permanent buff or not, though. Wait, the right has a chest, doesn't it? I think? I'm not sure. I guess there's nothing worth getting in there. Game enemies are just tiny enemies. Uh, wanna go down there or no? happened there.
All right, that's a charge weapon move. Okay, I see. I see you're doing that now. Man, those really make the spell fusion uh, multiplayer systems kind of pointless, huh? The ultimate weapons and the uh, and the haste weapon. Down there. How did that happen? I have a good sleep. Be slumber into the pretty soundtracks and sound of violence. Yeah. Alright, Laws, thanks for coming. I appreciate it. I will see you tomorrow, maybe. Well, on Twitter, probably, definitely. Yes, but. Probably not, uh. Out elsewhere. I don't know, actually. Maybe I'll stream tomorrow. It depends. yourself a good sleep. Is there any reason to go down to where the cure ring is in this dungeon? In this version? I guess so, because he's heading that way. Yeah. Oh. That's not the uke up ahead. I'm not the uke in front, huh? It's really hard to tell when every uke has the same colored helmet. Five enemies bunched up over there. Oh, there's a bomb with them. Okay. Uh, no giant enemies here, though? That's interesting. Not worth it for me.
Also, I gotta say, multiplayer, not having to hear Ma go, it's your turn to hold the chalice, Koopo, every two seconds is, uh, pretty nice. Wait, Koopo! All things considered, though, I do enjoy the voice acting in this game. Um, Boonto is tanking damage, huh? There we go. Unnecessary miasma damage. I know some of the voice actors in this game, so it's it's cool. Especially since it's a remake of a game that I knew about when I was a kid. Well, in high school. I'm holding the chalice and I'm being held back. I'm like, what the fuck? Why is that happening? Music is awesome too. Yeah, it is very good. I like the remixes. The remixes are very nice. And I like the new boss theme too. That one's cool. But you only hear it for like two or like three or four of the bosses. Holy Wrangles. getting confused. Or is it, is it an unnecessary chest? Because I didn't realize I didn't realize that most of the chests have set items in them at times. Or at least there's like specific ones that have set artifacts. Set regular items. What am I doing? I'm swinging at nothing. Also, no Phoenix down drops in this dungeon. Woo woo woo. Eh. Oh, never mind. We got all four of the relics already. Never mind. We don't need to hit any chests. Okay. Good to know. That confused the hell out of me with the last dungeon too, because I was like, wait a minute, how does this work? Everything's a everything's a relic? But you after you pick up four, you just can't pick up anything else. Also, I like how the game still says you can't take anything out of the final dungeon, but you clearly can in this version. It gives you the it gives you the reward thing at the end.
Right after I click that too. Oh, light. Now. Okay, it's getting a little ridiculous now. Come on! That was not fair. Here we go. Soon? Someday, maybe? Okay, there we go.
No, I should be looking at the mini map for the pummel because that helps me a lot. Good job, everyone. Hail Moogle at your service, Kapo. Kapo! I have a letter today, Kapo. One letter? I've never gotten more than one. Mother's story. We are capable of visiting both the future and the past. Our memories take us back while our hopes give us a glimpse of what may come. That is why the present is so important. Too complicated. You're right. Uh, here, take another piece of mithril. I don't need it. Jesus. Selkie ultimate weapon is really nice. Haste's all. Oh, so it's only for Selkies. Well, that's actually pretty, uh... Pretty useful for, uh... Pretty useful for Selkies. I've got your reply, Kapo. I know the, uh, the Yuke's ultimate weapons have the level 3 abilities. Yes, Kapo. Level 3 casts on them, which is ridiculous in multiplayer, because then you don't have to waste time fusing spells. Oh, that was loud. Was that a holy cure, uh, holy or raised uh, ring? Oh, yeah, blizzard ring, never mind. Paradise Garden, Lustrous, Rainbow Stone. Uh, I'll just take the Rainbow Stone. I don't really care. Yeah, oh, nice. Oh, that was the Holy Ring. Oh, the one down there? Nice. I have the Holy Ring. I don't have Gravity me or Meteor, though. I a Meteor dropped when I did Rainy Ruins before, but uh, I had the lowest, the lowest place, so I didn't get to choose it. Uh, I'm going to dissolve because I only have one more dungeon I want to do. Actually, I'm making pretty good time tonight. If this last dungeon doesn't take too long, I might take a break and then come back. Yeah, I know. Goblin Festival is the worst one. I, I, I know. Abs I absolutely am aware of that. I tried it and I couldn't get past the first enemy in it. Oh. Let's see if anyone's doing that right now. Nope. No one's doing it. It's difficult even with max end game gear. See, I thought Rainy Ruins was harder. I thought it was supposed to be the hard Rainy Ruins was supposed to be the hardest, but apparently uh you gotta have curse resistance gear. Oh shit, I don't have that. Uh, well, I guess need help. Kill Goblin Shaman very fast.
what? Oh. Oh, I do have curse resistance. Saintly mail. No helms, though. Ah, that's not really gonna help me, huh? Gotta do a few things in town. Fast cast, okay. Leave if I'm multiplayering. Uh, is there anything I would want to craft right now that I could craft? I don't think I can. It doesn't tell me. You can leave, just die. Yeah, I know. Uh, but I don't think I have anything I could do if I leave anyway. I hate getting bonus- I hate the getting the focus attack bonus condition. It's like, why am I gonna do that? Oh yeah, that's right, because you can't- you actually can't use a charge attack. Okay, I've wasted two Phoenix Downs already. So you'd have to change weapons, right? Curse resist armor. I have plus one curse resist. I don't have anything else right now. I'm gonna go see if maybe I have something that resists curse, but I'm not sure. I keep thinking there's a stain on my bed because I keep looking at it. There's like a dark spot, but it's just a piece of cloth that's like uh, folded over. This is the last dungeon I have to do too. After I finish this, I've beaten every dungeon, which is. Fine, I'm not grinding for ultimate stuff. I just want to be able to say I did it. game for a month and a half. It's hard to believe. But it's, it's almost done. One more dungeon and I'm finally done. Plus two stuff from Afternoon Fort. I mean, I might play multiplayer. Not on stream, though. My stream is... After I finish Afternoon... After I finish Goblin Festival, it's over. Because I've been playing... I've been streaming this for a month and a half now. I might still play on my off time, but... <sighs> yeah. But, uh... I'm, I'm done with the story. Uh... 
I have been trying to get more multiplayer streams incorporated, though. But I'm also trying to look for games where it's more like active talking to other people multiplayer. I would like to get an Among Us stream in, in at some point. But I'm also behind on what I want to stream. I should have been done with this in Legend of Mana, like, two weeks ago. Oh, oh Curse Resistance plus one. I'm missing white silk, though. Shit. Oh, that's a- that's a accessory, too. Higher. Oh, there's Curse Resist. I've copycat Moogle, but I don't have Moonstone or White Veil. You've been streaming your... Freelancing your streaming? Oh, like playing by yourself? I mean, that's what I usually do. The thing is, um... I realized that if I played with more people, it would probably make my streams better. Especially if I had more consistent chatter. So I don't know. Moonstone and White Veil. Dinner party, not afternoon fort. Oh, that's a quick one, too. It, don't have any Visage or Ethereal Orbs. I also have the Ring of Invincibility, which I also don't have enough to do. I have enough money to make one of them, but I don't have uh, the materials. It's a shame, too, because that's just what I needed. Shard. Curse and poison resist to run the dungeon, then drop poison for slow to start the boss, then drop slow for petrify once you open the gate and start hitting the boss. I gotta remember that petrify and stop are two different things. Slow and stop are different too, yeah. The issue is I've got so many games I want to play that, like, do you have the Wiseman's Charm? I Do I? I have to check. Problem is I've got so many... The fact that you can't access your equipment on the menu, on the world map is weird. I wish they would have fixed that. Wiseman's soul. It sounds familiar. Do I have it? I gotta check. Why can't you left and right page down on this, but like you can left and right page down here? It's always bothered me. Plus 15 magic damage. No, I don't have that. Not stat. I have the one that's magic. Da oh, I have wizard soul. Which is, uh, plus one. Which I'm assuming means it's plus five, because magic damage goes up for every, uh, for every, uh, five points. Yeah. That's what I was confused about, because I'm like, why does it just say magic damage plus one? Does that only mean it gives me one magic? But no, it's plus one five-point ranking. So this would be kind... Not really wasted, because I have 71 magic. So it would give me up to 76, technically. 
So if I had a, if I had Wiseman's Soul, that would be plus 15, which would be a magic damage plus 3. Okay. Wait, no? I'm wrong. I'm really confused. It's magic damage plus 15. Oh, so equipping that gives you 75 magic. On top of what you have now. Wow. So, so, so if I... It's hidden, your number doesn't go up. Yeah. So if I equipped it... If I equipped it, I'd essentially be doing double damage from one from what I have now. That's fucking cool, but I am not grinding for that. At least not here, not now. Actually, let me save too, since I haven't saved all stream yet. Six hours, 55 minutes. Autosave is a nice feature. Yeah, it is. What am I doing? So, question. Picking multi from the main menu, does that act any differently than hosting? It doesn't, right? No. Because it just sends me in here without setting um, options first. Am I doing multiplayer? Yeah. This is. I, I just need to do one run of this and I'm done. I'd rather not waste those now. Why is it? Oh, right. Multiplayer. Can't fuse. Just scoot over here. You want people to join me? Yeah, of course. I was doing it all single player, but these last few dungeons are just too much, and I'm just like, no, nah, forget it. Terrible bonus anyway. Fuck this. I want to do focus attacks. Having no easy way to quit out of a multiplayer dungeon is also kind of weird. I feel like that shouldn't be a thing.
Oh, I know that's because of the bonus condition. Interesting. There's one that says level up, even though there's no leveling in this game. Lobbies cannot be made in quick succession. Please wait and try again later. Oh. What a pain. I was so confused. I'm like, why is it th one and three? And I'm like, oh, wait a minute. It's because they, they level up over time. Oopsie doopsies. Alright, uh... Journey log. Oh, it oh, cool. Oh, so that's what the follow meant at the end. Okay, I see. Left wall walkie, walking guy. Uh, I'm not sure why not. I've never used any of this. Ten? Oh, out of a hundred. Okay. A bit awkward. I mean, I already saved. I don't know what I'm saving again for. Give me a moment. So that works, but like creating a lobby doesn't. That's weird. Defeat enemies with. God damn it, no. I'm in it now. <laughs> Join literally as I died. Eh, whatever. I don't care.
I am definitely way out of my league here. Yeah. Oh dear. One level of curse resistance is not enough. Not move forward, and know why that happened.
Die from poison damage. It's actually never happened before. Also, I automatically moved into the circle again. No wonder they were saying you need curse resistance here, Jesus. Notice all the enemies down there. Holy! first or I don't know whichever whichever way we're supposed to go here
have wandered so far off to the right there. other thing though. Wandered off when I couldn't see myself. Oh wait, dead end. Oops. Wait. Uh, is this the way we're supposed to go? Yeah, it is. Okay, because we can go over there. Even after a month and a half, I still can't fully remember these, uh... These layouts. So, uh, one and two. I might have to, uh, screen that next year.
noticed. Tome of Ultima. Oh, shit. Nice. That's a uh, plus 10 magic, isn't it? Okay, but this is just where we were. All right. I'm not getting that. Someone else is going to be grabbing that probably at the end of the mission. <laughs> My, my mission is to do focus attacks, which I'm absolutely not doing. Oh shit, how'd that happen? I gotta pay attention. What? I got, uh, ganged up on. Stone to clear. That's weird. Want nothing. 
that's something. Candy ring. It's two, two uh, artifacts. Watch this the first mission again. Three Selkie, or three Ukes, one Selkie. Or was it a Clavat last time? Clavet. Man, it is cruel that they make you go through two loading zones just to hit that switch. I'm sure in the GameCube version it wasn't as bad, but here where it's where it's lag central when you load an area in. Though I guess it's not so bad in multiplayer, honestly. It's worse in single player. For this boss is quite the pain in the ass.
I didn't have to walk up there. Spam's fast meteor. That's incredible. Oh, I see, just hitting him petrifies you. Wild. Stand back here while I pull this up. Never mind.
Whew. Jesus. I was barely able to provide support there. We do indeed got this. Wow. Thank you for all the help. You and the other two people here. I have a letter today, Kupo. Yeah, I'm definitely going to need to uh, work on the stats if I want to grind this later. Mother told me that Moogles sleep in trees, but I think they'd fall. Tell me, can it really be true? Uh, yes, it's true, I guess. I don't really need to do this anymore. I'm just going for the hell of it. Taking the Mimic Crystal. I mean, I don't know what the other two people are going to do, because I've definitely got the lowest score out of everyone here. I've got your reply, I did not bother with focus attacks. It would have not helped, honestly. See you again, Kupo. Yeah. <laughs> I'm fine with taking a crystal, honestly. I, again, I'm, I, I can grind on my own time. Ooh, Amadati, perfect. That's the one his crystal. Beautiful. Oh. All right. I think I'm good. Oh, wait, can I? Oh yeah, you can. I'll give you a follow, just in case I ever do play again. I'll follow him too, just because uh, he was in multiple matches here. Whew. Well, that's a taste of what I'm gonna have to deal with if I uh, if I decide to keep grinding later and max out my stats. Uh, but. I think I'll uh, let this scene play out one last time. Close out the stream for now. Take a break. You do speedrun co-ops that I probably won't add just to reduce the chances of randoms jumping in. That was fun nonetheless. Oh, cool. Thank you for joining me. This is where my stream of this game ends, though. I'm not going to be streaming any more of this. Uh, I've done... 13 streams now of varying lengths. So I think I could consider the book on this one closed. I might play offline though, so. Not offline, off stream. So definitely, uh. I'll keep an eye out. Keep an eye out on your friends list. Antlion. Some of the bosses are renamed and some of them aren't. I may need it, I may not. What I what I might need luck is a smash on Tuesday. Green dragon instead of zombie dragon. Oh, some of these entries are different than what they were for uh normal ones. I'm assuming multiplayer gives you different responses when you beat a dungeon. Yeah, cool. 
I've seen everything in the game now, aside from just end game equipment. I am satisfied. I am very happy. It was fun visiting this, revisiting this game. Uh, well, visiting it for the first time. I watched my brother play through the original. I never played it myself. Uh, but it was nice playing through it. It was cool hearing people I know doing the voices in the game. Uh, and I'm glad I played through it, even though it took forever. Goblin Lord. I might play a new character at some point, honestly, when I get bored and just grind some artifacts out and do runs and stuff. My diary from year 17. So 17 years and it took me 13 streams to beat it. Not bad. It's almost one year per stream. That's also because the first two streams I did of this, I only did like two dungeons each, just because there was so much uh so much in between. Also, I didn't do some of these on stream, too. Actually, it was kind of one year per stream, because there was two years that I did off stream. So it was 15 years over 13 streams. Plus, I technically did one as a guest, so that would be another dungeon down. World map, save, and we can finally exit this. You're on year three, first time you played since you were a kid. I've never played it. This was my first actual playthrough. I tried playing it and um, when I, on the GameCube and I just didn't like it for some reason. It was also because I, I had just finished watching my brother play through the whole game, so it felt very repetitive. But after, uh, how many years has it been? 17? 13? No, 18. It came out in 2000, 2003, so it is 17 years. Or maybe it was 2004, I don't know. It was 2004, I think. It's better with the full group of 2003, okay. It was better with friends, I'll say that. And it's kind of a shame, because I played through the whole game single player until tonight. And then I did the last three, uh... The last four dungeons as multiplayers. Uh, but I am going to take a break, short break. Um, you know what I'll do? I'll let the um, I'll let the extended credits play just to properly close this out. I'm going to mute myself, take a quick break, and I will come back with Legend of Mana, which I've been putting off for a whole month, and I'll finally do some of that. That's going to require me to uh, configure some of my shit though. But uh, yeah, I'll be back in like five minutes or so.
ruined in the last second by the uh, sleep uh, dim mode. This is technically connected to my TV. Uh, but yeah, I'm back. Uh, just uh, cleaned up a bit, had some water, getting myself refreshed. Uh, that's, that, that's Crystal Chronicles. I really enjoyed it. I've said it before just a few minutes ago, but man, worth playing through, despite some of the tedium and some of the bullshit that they didn't fix in the remastered edition. Uh, I enjoyed it. I'll probably go back to it at some point when I'm not, uh, on stream. Yeah. 